Hey guys, how are you doing? It's Cam back at you again and today we're checking out the newest Charvel ever with a brand new Charvel SoCal Style 2. For those of you who know me well, I'm a bit of a Charvel connoisseur, and my friends at Charvel very kindly sent me this Style 2 to check out, and I have to say it's very different to what I'd normally try out. I mean, most of you know me for the San Dimas and DK24, Floyd Roses and Loud Finishes, but it's a really, really nice guitar. It's a little bit more subdued that you'd normally see from a Charvel. For example, obviously you've got the blacked out Ash, reverse Tele headstock, which I think is really cool, and it also shares some other specs that I haven't otherwise seen before. If I could sum it up in a sentence, I don't normally start with a verdict, but it is a quietly styled monster. The monster part I'll get to later on. We have Charvel branded locking tuners, a tusk nut, a caramelized maple neck and fingerboard, compound radius stretching from 12 to 16 inches, 24 jumbo frets, lumen lay side dots which glow in the dark, a little feature taken from the DK24 two points. We have a thumb wheel truss rod adjustment, and I said again, an ash body. For those of you who stick by this channel will know I reviewed the old yellow Sandemus uh, about a week back. And it's a really, really cool guitar. But that guitar weighed a ton. Ash seems to vary depending on which guitar you pick up. And that one, that particular guitar weighs a fair bit. And this one, Ash again, but is the lightest guitar I've ever picked up. I don't weigh guitars, but I had to weigh this one. And it barely weighs six pounds. Absolutely crazy. It's got all the relevant contouring as well that you'd normally get. It's got beveled output jack here and the forearm contour. So it's just a really nice ergonomically comfy instrument. It's really cool. Goto 510 bridge, which is a really nice bridge if you want to channel your inner Hank Marvin. We have a volume, a push-pull tone, and a two-way mini toggle, and finally, three-way blade switch. For the Fishman Fluence, I said it was a monster, Fishman Fluence Open Core Classics. Now, I've seen Fluences before. The first time I tried them was when I reviewed the Charvel Satchel signature model a few months back, so if you want to go and check that out and hear some Panther, go that way. If I could sum up Fishman Fluences, they're my favourite active pickups, I have to say. And for those of you who play Fluence guitars will know what I mean when I say they make everything feel really smooth, really full, really big, and also somehow support you in those lead moments. They, they sort of cover your back somehow. If you can sum it up in better words, Put it in the comments but for those of you who play fluence know exactly what i mean they're very helpful you get three voices with these pickups as well which i'll talk about in a second but with the three-way toggle you get first bridge humbucker in the middle you get both humbuckers together and in the third position neck humbucker so in voice one you basically get a supercharged sort of path set which is really nice my favorite position voice two which is like a super hot rotted it, if I could compare it to anything, it's like an EMG, but a little smoother with a little bit more top end, so a little bit more useful as far as like recording situations are concerned. Voice 3, which is super glassy and shiny single coil positions, and the wiring is slightly different. You have the outer coil of the bridge pickup in the first position, both outer coils in the second position, and then you get the really woolly outer coil in the neck pickup there. And for those of you who might criticise saying why put that on a 24 fret guitar, that's what your tone knob's for. So if you want some extra creaminess, back that off and it will work just fine. Other than that, a really diverse and eclectic instrument and an all-round spot-on guitar. Really impressed with it. If I could ever critique anything, more colours please. 
It's a really nice guitar though, I must say. The Charvel SoCal Style 2. For those of you who want to know my setup, I'm plugged straight into a Yamaha THR32. No post mixing. Thanks so much for watching this video, you guys. I hope you've liked what you've seen. If you enjoyed this video, please smash that like button. I appreciate it very much. And if you're digging me enough, subscribe as well. I'd really appreciate that very much. And if you enjoyed this guitar, let me know what you think in the comments. I'll see you really soon. Bye-bye.